<sighs> What's up guys, Kenny Tavern here. I'm going to try to block this light with my head because if I don't, it blinds my camera. <laughs> Anyways, I'm uh, going to share with you this light that I bought. I bought it a while ago. It's pretty sweet. Um, I was trying to like buy these UV lights and get them on my boat and stuff. And I have like some DeWalt adapters that I... Uh, I put on my, I put a light bar on like a DeWalt adapter and I use these adapt battery adapters. I have one uh, Milwaukee adapter that I power my bait box with. Should make a video on how to do that because that has been a game changer with my bait box. They take those big uh, D batteries, but with the, the uh, adapter, you just plug that. I can show you how to, I took the car charger broke that down and hooked it up to a Milwaukee adapter and then you just plug that onto a battery and it runs my bait box for days. It's awesome. And it doesn't lose any battery at all. It's awesome. Anyways, I I was looking to make a UV light out of one of those things. I found, but I found this light. It was like 40 bucks on Amazon. It's completely rechargeable. It, you can even charge your cell phone with this thing. It's freaking awesome. I'm going to show you my rods. Oh, you want to see my rods? I'm going to show you my rods. If you watch my channel, you know that I like enjoy the Mad Cat's rods. I'm going to turn this thing on. And there's my rods under the UV light. This thing's pretty sweet, man. I really, uh, I really like this light. It's got a couple different settings. This is high. This is low. Low is perfect. If it's super dark outside, like pitch black, you're in an area where there's no lights, no street lights or anything. Because there are people that fish like in town by bridges and stuff. And, you know, there could be lights around, which is beneficial to you. But, you know, this low light, it's perfect. And then uh, it does this like SOS deal, I think. Um, and then it blinks really fast. I'm pretty sure that's SOS, but I'm not 100% positive on that. Anyways, guys, there's my three Mad Cats rods all lit up. I'll turn, uh, turn these to the side so you can see the line. You can really... On this green big game trilene in this Andes. I know you can't see it in the video, but in person, this stuff, it glows, man. And that's what I love about using a UV light at night when I've got the rods in the water in the boat. And you hook into a fish and you're like, where's my line at? And you can really see with this UV light. It's pretty awesome. So, uh, that's been a really helpful tool for me with these mad cats rods before um i used to just go to walmart and i would buy packs of glow sticks like 100 glow sticks for like five bucks and i would just electrical tape a glow stick to the end of my rod and there's uh, honestly nothing wrong with that i still do that uh because sometimes this uv light will attract more bugs than you really want to have around so um, yeah, you always have to have a backup contingency plan to, to that. If I go night fishing, I take my glow sticks, I take my, um, take my bells. I have several different types of bells. And then I take this UV light headlamps and I take some other stuff. Uh, but yeah, I love this thing, especially with the Mad Cat's rods. I have a... Another Mad Cat rod, the Smash rod, it's purple with green accents around the uh, eyelets. Kind of like this. It's purple and then it has green here and here. And the green glows really, really good. But uh, the purple doesn't glow at all. <laughs> uh, didn't think it would, but my favorite has got to be that blaze, Blazing rod. I love that rod. When I was in the store looking at rods, I was like, man, I don't know about this place. Rod. Purple and uh, orange, and it's ended up being my favorite rod that I own. They have lots of rods that I'd love to get my hands on, but at 120 or 110 bucks a rod, I mean, it's hard to just go to the store and go crazy on rods. You know what I mean? 
and they're always going to be coming out with more colors that are bright and vibrant like these. Now this light will work with other rods too. I'm not saying Mad Cat's like the only rod this will work with. This will work with uh, Hellcats. It'll work with um, tangling with catfish rods. Any rod that is bright in color. Um, and don't get it, don't get it twisted. The, the, a white rod will not light up under this UV light. Trust me, I've got white rods. They don't light up under UV lights. Um, you know, if you have a white rod that has like yellow on it, the yellow will light up depending on the, the paint that was used. But yeah, uh, this light's been uh, really good to me. Um, I'm going to put the link in the description below. So if you're interested, you ain't got to search for it. You just go down there, click on it. It'll take you right to the, uh, right to the link. Go ahead and get yourself one. I'm going to get myself another one so I can have two on the boat. So that'll be really nice. Maybe if I have my rods spread out a little further, uh, this can hit more of an area. So anyways, guys, I'm going to sign out. Uh, yeah. Give the video a like if you liked it. Hit the subscribe button to see me fishing with this thing or whatnot. And uh, go down to the description, hit the link, and get yourself one if you liked it. So Kenny Tavern out. I'll see you on the next round. Have a good one, guys.